Hi, my name is Nasmus and welcome to another video blog on Atmosphere. And today's topic is going to be on updates. Yes, Atmosphere updates. Well, well, I want to ask you, what is your killer update for Atmosphere? I mean, not updates that have been released, but a future possible update. What update do you want most in Atmosphere? Or it could be an update that you've been waiting for, what, like five or past three years? It could be a new thing that you thought would make Atmosphere great. Uh, for example, like you would think, oh, hey, how about this? Um, it could be something put in the idea section or something to think about. But I'm curious to know, what does the community think would make a great update to Atmosphere? Um, you could just say bug fixes, but I'm, I'm, I want to be in a more... I want, Bug fixes, yes. We all want. We all want bug fixes. Atmosphere is really buggy, and bug fixes will make it great. But aside from bug fixes, what update would make it really good, really, really, really good? And something I've been waiting for years, or just thought about and thought it's great. Well, I have. Uh, to me, uh, one update that I think would make atmosphere great is atmosphere is not modern. Well, it's modern, but not iPad, iPhone modern. When apps like iPad apps, iPhone apps, everything is animation, everything smooth, and all the app has, has, an, has an immersive experience. Well, Atmosphere on the PC and Mac is a window with buttons and not a lot of animations. Well, it's hard to explain what I mean, but if you look at the examples of Windows 8 applications or applications for the iPad, everything is more immersive. So what I was planning, what I was thinking, a perfect update or a nice update for Atmosphere would be a new, whole new user experience. Think about it. Imagine, imagine this. You start Atmosphere. You have a full screen experience with a nice Atmosphere loading loading sign. When Atmosphere loads, everything swipes up uh, to view. All the level, all the most popular or most featured levels pop up with Design of the Week on the side and slideshow, a small slideshow showing the newest, coolest features. Or and um, there's lots of buttons and. It's not. Very, it's, it's, I, I'm not thinking of something that'll get in your way. I'm thinking something that'll let the content out. Um, the new Windows 8 applications, for example, it's going to hide all these buttons and technical stuff. It's going to let the content shine. So think of an atmosphere as a, as a whole white page with a small with with all your levels popping out, all all the featured levels coming, well, present being presented to you. And when you click a level, and all animation occurs. Let's say these levels fade fades away or swipes away, and new levels pop up. And you click a certain level, say all these levels pop uh, go away, and your level smoothly and uh, very fluidly comes into view with uh, with being able to comment, rate, and stuff. It's not like rather window or small small mini buttons. It's hard to explain. So I'm thinking of doing a uh, what do you call it? A video demo of that of my concept. Um, I don't know when it's gonna be out, but I'm working on it. But uh, I'm, I'm, but anyways, it's hard. For my it's hard to explain what I'm trying to ex uh, explain to you. But um, but that's not important at the moment. I want to know what you want as your update. What kind of update are you looking for? What would make Atmosphere a killer app again? It's already awesome app. But what update would make it awesome? So thanks a lot, guys, and stay tuned to Atmosphere and. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, but I'm really excited to find out what the new business model is. Um, we'll, can we to find out? So we'll talk about that more when that comes. Until then, cheers.